Hey guys, what's up? My name's Emily Shea. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, for today's video, I wanted to show you guys how I do my Tangled Bound. Um, I'm hoping to do a little series on my channel where I do my hair and my makeup and have a little outfit inspired by different Disney princesses. And so for my first bound, I wanted to do Tangled because that is my favorite movie. Um, but if you guys have suggestions of other princesses you'd like to see, go ahead and let me know in the comments down below and I'll be sure to get to it. Um, but for right now, let's do Tangled. Alright, so first things first is I'm going to do my moisturizer. I always do this before I do my makeup. It just helps my skin breathe. Um, so I'm going to be using this Olay Whip Moisturizer all over my face first. And I always like to moisturize before putting on my makeup just because it makes my skin feel so much better. And it also makes the makeup go on more smooth. Um, so I always do moisturizer before my makeup. Another thing I always do before my makeup is prime my face. And this just makes my makeup stick longer, go on smoother, um, all that kind of stuff. So today I have my e.l.f. blemish primer and I really like it. It's a really nice drugstore primer. I am not one to spend loads and loads of money on makeup. So I just use my drugstore products and they work great for me. So, um... This is what it is, but I will have everything in the description box below for you to look at if you want to know what kind of products I'm using. Um, I'll have them listed in the box below. All right, now I think we're ready for foundation. So um, I already wet my beauty sponge and I'm just gonna get my foundation on. This foundation it's a another drugstore product I like to use and it's a pretty matte finish and that's what I like in my foundations it's also pretty good coverage um so yeah I really like this one again it'll be in the description below Alright, now that we have our foundation on, we're going to go with some concealer and another drugstore product, my e.l.f. Camo Concealer. I really like this product, but it is pretty thick, so if you don't like thick concealers or you have sensitive skin, you may not like this product, but it works pretty good for me, so... Alright, next thing in my makeup routine is I'm going to powder, so I'm going to bake underneath my under eye and loosely powder the rest of my face. Now that we're all powdered, um, we're looking a little like a ghost, so we're going to go ahead and bronze up the face. So I am doing more of a natural look today, um, not too bronze. Just because Rapunzel was locked in the tower all day. She's probably not sun-kissed and bronzed like we all hope to be. She's more pale. So I'm going to do a little light on the bronzer. And um, a little heavier on the blush, I think. For blush, I have my Tangled Collection from ColourPop Cosmetics. I love this collection. It's so cute. Look at the little box. And then it comes with a blush and a lipstick, and I love it. It's so cute. 
and it's just a little tangled blush. All right, now comes the fun part, the eyes. Um, so I'm gonna take my James Charles palette and we're gonna do a little purpley pink kind of eye moment. I know that's not something Rapunzel would wear, but I wanted to do a little play on her outfit. And so we're gonna do a purple and pink eye look. So let's do that. All right, one thing I always like to do before doing my eyeshadow is just give my face a little spritz with setting spray. So I have the Professional Setting Spray from Benefit Cosmetics. Now I did say I don't like spending too much money on makeup. Uh, this was gifted to me uh, by the brand, so I use it and I really like it. I might actually end up purchasing it more when I run out because it's a really nice setting spray. It's just expensive. Um, I think that there are better setting sprays. I really like the e.l.f. setting spray as well. That's what I was using before I was gifted this one. Um, and that one's a great alternative. It's super cheap and it works really well. So, all right, now we're going to move on to the eyes. And so when I'm using the James Charles palette, I find that I need a primer, um, to make the eyeshadows really pop. And I don't have an eye primer, so I just use my concealer and it works really well for me. So if you're someone who doesn't have an eye primer, just use your concealer. It works pretty well. Okay, now we're gonna get into the eye makeup. So I think I'm gonna go in with a transition shade first. So I'm gonna go in with this little brown shade over here as a, just as a transition all over my lid. All right, now for the fun part, the colors. So I think I'm gonna go with this um middle purple right here not too light and not too dark i'm gonna go in with that one first Now I'm going to take a clean blender and we're just going to blend out those edges. Alright, now we're going to deepen up the outer corner. So we're just going to go in with this deeper shade of purple, just the tiniest amount. All right, you guys, I have my outfit all put together. Um, for my top, I just have a white little crop top, and then I have a purplish pink mini skirt to go with it. And then if I was wearing this out, I would probably wear a pair of white sneakers or um, some pink he heels, maybe something like that. And then to finish off my look, I have my little tangled lounge fly backpack. And I just think this is the cutest little outfit. Let me know what you guys think. I almost forgot. I do have my little tangled crown. 
I can't believe I almost forgot to add this into my outfit. I think it's the perfect little touch um, for a little princess Disney bound. I definitely wear this to Disney, um, take a picture in front of the castle. I think that would be super cute. Um, so yeah, this is my completed look. you guys enjoyed watching my video today and if you have any requests for princesses you would like to see next go ahead and like I said before leave it in the comments below so I can see um and yeah check out my Instagram where I do more princess bounds as well as lounge fly outfits and that kind of stuff so if you want to check me out over there it will be linked in the description as well as my TikTok I do a bunch of random stuff over there um that will also be linked below but yeah uh, thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed.